behind the right-hander Brandon Fought, who gets first crack at this Cardinals lineup as we open up a three-game weekend set with St. Louis. Here's Brendan Donovan serving as the Cardinals DH tonight. Donovan at 256 on the air, a couple of homers, eight driven in. Smoked into center field, a leadoff single. Good start for Brendan Donovan. Well, a couple early runs would be a real big help against this Arizona team. Hard to believe it's been six years since Goldschmidt last played in a Diamondback uniform and is still one of the best to ever play for this organization. And he takes ball four low. Now Donovan moves to second base. Nolan Gorman is coming up. First and second, nobody out. Nolan Gorman, of course, from Phoenix, Arizona. And he has quite a cheering section here tonight at Chase Field. Chops this one out, a change up from Fought. Very shallow left center. Guriel runs it down. Lurtis on a long way to get to that one. And that's the first out for Fought. At some point, somebody in the National League is going to pay for the early season frustrations of Nolan Arenado. You know, he's putting in the work every single day. You know, he's beating himself up about the start that he's having. Nobody is more aware of the issues than that man right there. And he's. Like you said, it's going to click. You know what he is at the, the back of his baseball card. You just hope it starts happening soon because the Cardinals have had a few games here recently where a little bit of offense would have gone a long way. Swing and a high fly ball. Belted deep left. Nolan Arenado says, hello, Phoenix. 3 nothing Cardinals. Oh, did that feel good. Arenado hitting his first home run since the 19th of August, 2023, against Singa of the New York Mets. <laughs> Three nothing Cardinals. Man oh man you can see the weight of the world off his shoulders. Good For to see sure. him smiling in the dugout. Contreras hitting 231 with a couple of homers and he's driven in four. Another 3 2 a check swing and then a flip of the bat by Contreras and he flipped it over the head of the umpire. I don't know if I've ever seen that before. Grant Strom is out there already in the first inning with one out. The Cardinals have had four base runners, three have scored. So, welcome back to Lars Newt Bar. Talking with Ollie before the game, both Lars and he feel he got enough at bats to be ready to go from pitch one. Newt Bar pops it up, light sky right now. Newman backing up, Guriel coming in. And Kevin Newman is waiting the left fielder, and that's out number two. And Jordan Walker is next. Let's see if. Jordan can get the ball airborne in this hitter friendly park. Swing and a lazy pop up to the right side. It is the second baseman, Cattell Marte, into foul territory, making a nice catch. And the inning finally comes to an end. Diamondbacks facing a left hand starting pitcher for the ninth time this season. That's the most of the majors. Tonight, it's Steven Matz. Well, a lot of time to get back in the game. The D backs very good at scoring early in games. There's a chopper hit towards short. Short hop pick and a high throw, but Goldie makes the play. For out number one. Corbin Carroll, the National League Rookie of the Year. Swing and a base hit into left field by Carroll. It's bobbled for a moment by Lars Newbar, but uh, Carroll not going to try and test it for two. A one out single as he continues to find his swing, does Carroll. Third is Guriel Jr. batting 308. He leads the Diamondbacks in hits, RBIs, and OPS. Runner goes. Pitch is a strike. There'll be no throw. Ball pops out of the glove of Contreras, and Carroll is in safely with his fourth stolen base. The pitch by Matz. There's a swing and a fly ball hit to left center field, but tracked well by Newtbar, who makes the catch. Newtbar was playing well off the line, and a good thing. Had he been playing straight up, that's an extra base hit. So now it's up to Walker to get a clutch two out hit. Swung on and miss a changeup, strikes out Walker. Boy, it's good to see the Cardinals with three runs, four hits, and they're not through the second inning today. Donovan singled and scored ahead of Arenado's homer in the first. A swing, and Donovan hits that in the air to right field. Grichik is under it, making the catch. The runner's tag, crossing with a run. Mason win. 4 nothing Cardinals as Brendan Donovan drives in his ninth run of the young season. Nice pitch. You know, you don't expect a guy like Goldschmidt taking a pitch like that with a runner on third base in less than two outs. But Fott won that battle with a great fastball right to Moreno's glove. Here is Nolan Gorman flew out to left field his first time up. There's a gap shot towards left center field. Carroll racing and making a sliding catch to prevent a fifth run from scoring. And that could be big as we move deeper into this ball game. But Steven has a six run lead here in the third inning. Yeah, that's something that the Cardinals pitching staff has not had much of is a cushion like this. Lined in a right field, Walker on the run, dives and makes the catch. He gets it in quickly, and they're going to double up. 
Newman on second base. A double play, what a play by Walker. And he threw from his knees, he turns it into a double play. That should be an error on Matz. Again, I mentioned he's typically a good fielder. I think he may have rushed that a little he bit. He rushed it. Well, a runner on, one out, and now, hello, Newman. Kevin Newman steps in. Swing and a ball hit out towards left center field. Long run, Newbar can't reach it. That's down all the way to the center field wall. Look at those orange cleats coming around third. Kevin Newman with his second hit, and the Diamondbacks are on the board. Newman's second RBI this season for the Diamondbacks. And now the top of the order is coming up with a man in scoring position. And let's see if Arizona can get something cooking here at home. Base hit. Newman coming home. Marte drives in a run, and it's six to two. All right. Third time through the order this year, hitters have hit Mats at a 400 clip, and it's starting to happen right now. There's a swing and a liner over the leap of win into center field, a base hit. Marte scores. Another run is in, and it's now six to three. Cardinal left-hander Stephen Mats frustrated in the dugout, stake to a six-nothing lead in the third. He will not survive the fifth as Oliver Marmel goes to his bullpen. And now with Suarez, who's a clutch hitter, has always been a clutch hitter. Great opportunity for him. Gino not waiting around, pokes it toward the Cardinal bullpen. This one's carrying out there, and it's gone. Hey, Eugenio Suarez, and we are tied at six. Get him on, get him over, and get him in. That'll work. The slide got the job done. He was going to be out, Ricky. I think he was, too. So now Goldie can give the Cardinals the lead against his former teammates. Served in the center of base hit. He went down and stroked that baby, and the Cardinals are back in front. Oh, does that feel good? A two-strike hit for Goldschmidt at 7-6. to six. But all of a sudden, there's some pressure on this Diamondback bullpen again, Candy. Yeah, got to keep it right here. You're down by one. Swing and a line drive, and it's fair down the right field line. The ball veers into foul territory as Siani scores. The ball rolls around and coming around second base, going for third with a stand-up triple. Mason win. And it's a triple for a win. The Cardinals lead by two. And that came at a great time. And now he's in scoring position for Victor Scott the second. Now Victor Scott shoots one towards center. Carroll the catch. Here comes the runner tagging. Here comes the throw to the plate. It's going to be cut off. A two-run inning and a three-run lead for the Cardinals at 9-6 in Phoenix. And one out to go for another save for Helsley. Arizona's had uh, a nice comeback in this game, but so far in the ninth they have been uh, petering out. That they have. He got him. Swing and a miss. Helsley picks up his fifth save, and the Cardinals win a wild one out west. 9-6, a game one victory.